Dear friends, since assuming presidency a little over a year ago, I've had the pleasure of traveling throughout the state of Israel. It has been a privilege to meet the women and men and the children, including, of course, those in Akko, Akra, who comprise the tapestry of our nation. We have our differences, that's natural at every society, but at the very core lies the quiet grace and dignity with which all of us strive to coexist. I have seen this time and again and constantly draw great inspiration from it. There is an ongoing process of dialogue between Jew and Arab in our country. And this is no trivial matter, especially in a region where sectarian violence and conflict are all too common. We often live in parallel worlds and our interactions with those different from us are sometimes transactional in nature. True friendships, however, can only come from a shared organic experience, which is difficult to create. But for this reason, the work of the ACO Center for Arts and Technology is nothing short of extraordinary. It is within your walls that Jews, Christians and Muslims, and Druze of course, the beautiful streams of our Israeli mosaic, find common ground through pursuits which enrich both the individual and the collective. I know ACAT very, very well for many years, and I have huge respect for ACAT. And I've seen how over these past years, you've created an island of inspiration where coexistence turns into bonds of friendship. Your story is more than a model for our nation. It should be the standard to which we aspire. We must strive to make this commonplace where friendship and camaraderie are the rule, not the exception. I would like to recognize my good friend Bill Strickland, who traveled to Israel to join tonight's festivities and who used his powerful personal story to create a model for change in Pittsburgh and indeed around the world. Thank you to USAID, the Sarowitz family and the Ted Arison Family Foundation for your enduring support of this noble idea and project. And special thanks to Naim Obeid, a cat CEO and the spirit behind it all for your hard work. And of course, my good friend Mark Frank, President and Chair. So thank you all for your leadership and vision. And I wish you all great success in your celebrations for the ACAT Center. May you continue success as you promote peace and harmony here in the Holy Land. Toda rabato.